Hi everyone. I am exhausted. My back side hurts. Doesn't hurt as much anymore, but it still kind of hurts like right where like I don't know where that fat deposit chunk uh like I don't know all that hip bone right in the back. That's hurting. My sh both shoulders are hurting. My lungs are hurting. My stomach is hurting and not from f uh, lack of food or hunger. Just from breathing and like being exhausted. And like I'm tired. I want to take a nap. I gotta wait for my sister to get home. And I'm exhausted because I was carrying some heavy bags. I was in a Christmas haul. Yay. And the most heavy thing is what I got from Dollarama. It's a huge bag of Dollarama stuff. And all of them stocky stuffers. Ah, from one Dollarama store. And I wasn't able to do like three stores that I wanted to do when I went down to Eastgate. So that's gonna have to be another day. Ah, I don't like the fact that I can't uh, go earlier. I have to wait till my sister gets on the bus. It's lovely. And it's now going, I'm now realizing as I was coming home that it's because of me having to get my sister on the bus and you know dad leaving before you know it's gonna it's screwing up my black friday shopping like going there for you know like 6 30 in the morning and be there for when they open stores open at seven in the morning where is it in the morning i don't know it's just ridiculously early i have to get up at four in the morning on a friday and then you know uh, not anymore, apparently, because I have to wait to get my sister on the bus. So, I'm going to show you what I got today. A majority of it is just stocking stuffers and a shit ton of peanuts. A shit ton of peanuts. So, my first bag is from Shoppers. Shoppers Drug Mart. This I had to put in a separate bag because... Just so that I wasn't completely crushing it, but I feel like I crushed it a chunk. But whatever. These are limited limited edition, limited time only, not limited edition. Doritos Sonic Sour Cream. And I got the ah for Manny's chips because he really likes these. I like them too. I they're missing the onion for me, which I don't I I I love sour cream and onion. And this is okay, but I it's it's missing the onion which because, yeah that's just it but yeah this is for his stocking stuffer because everyone gets a nice big bag of chips and I've seen a shit ton of like the mini bags or like the snack bags but he doesn't want those and that was the first this was the first time I found like the big bags and I had to purchase something because I it got lost in the big load of stuff anyway. This is for Dad and Manny. So we got some Munchies Crunchy Coated Peanuts Baked Nut Fried Sweet Spicy Flavor. Munchies, just some regular peanuts. More Munchies. These are also Crunchy Coated in Babaku. Mun more Munchies Regular Babaku. They're not coated. And then I got some honey roasted peanuts. And that was all from Shoppers. That chip bag. This, this is the elusive one that was like, I'm going to hide and you're going to have to pay extra, somewhat extra, you know, waste some more of your money. Walmart in the Walmart bag. Oh, this arm hurts. Oh, both arm hurts. Well, this shoulder hurts the most, but this arm really hurts. So this is just a mishmash of stocking stuffers, stuff for me, and gift stuff. I think I have one, one gift, maybe two, because I might just stick it in with stocking stuffers, but we'll see. All right, now, this thing you can see is a stocking with dog treats in it and it's a pink one and you get the pink one you get a piggy piggy 
but everything else in here, everything else in here, like there's another stuffy, a squeaky plastic bone, a soft ball, a tennis ball, and a rope. And that's what you get in here. This is six pieces, a from the Holiday Time brand, from through Walmart. Dog toy stocking for $7.93. I'm just gonna take everything out of this and put it in her stocking just because. Yeah. I got these. I I I don't know if you fully know, but I get I eat oatmeal every morning for breakfast. I get the brown sugar cinnamon brand flavor because I really like that. And I was looking on a while ago, I was looking on the US Walmart. Uh, online website and they had these and they had the cinnamon spice they also had other like flavors that we don't get in Canada and I'm like why and today I saw these and I'm like I'm gonna try them because I do like cookies and cream I'm good I'm not really gonna tell you how much everything is unless it has a price so that didn't really have a price I found these these are a Marvel brand and how I have dog fur on them I have no idea my own hair, it makes sense. These are men's pajama pants, 100% polyester, but whatever. These are for winter. They just keep his legs warm. And these are a Deadpool. Oh, hold on, let me just find it right there, see? A Deadpool riding a unicorn, right? You know, it's a horse, it's a horse. But, um,. It looks like, yes, it's a unicorn. A unicorn. And this is an extra large because of his waist size. Is it something to 34? So, and this, it goes to a 34. So, this is his size. This is a gift. It's for my sister. Just, it's a pajama set because she needs more pajama sets and less mishmash bottoms and tops. And this was, what, this actually had a price on it. These were, these were also in their own kind of like box thing that they had out. These were $14.97. This is $26.97. This is a Disney brand. It is a ladies pajama set. Mm, it's a nice picture right there. You can see what it looks like. I would never wear these pants. I can't wear them, but because they're for my sister, I really don't care. And there's glitter. Yeah, there's glitter outlining his ears. Oh, his entire head and the the bottom. If I'm looking at the picture right, uh, you probably can't tell in the picture, but right there, that black line edge there, at the bottom of the shirt. From that black edge to like Mickey's face, there's a glitter line. The same glitter line as this, but that's cool. And yeah, that, that, that's that. Here's a stocking stuffer. This is for Manny. It is Red Zone Old Spice Swagger Body Wash. Eight hour scent technology. Yeah. He doesn't really uh, use shampoo conditioner, but because he shaves his head. So I get the body wash because he, that's about, you know, what a majority he washes. And this smelled good. I smelled a lot of stuff and the swagger actually smelled really good. So that's why I got it. I got for myself, for my bottom coat, because it's nice, the Witchcraft Rock Solid Original nail hardener. As I said, I prefer this. I really like this. And they changed this, the top here. See, it's white here. This was my last one and they made it a gray black. What are you doing? At least they kept the consistency of like how tall it is and how much you get. I'm banging stuff. There's a, a great value, which is a Walmart brand of Honey glazed peanuts. I don't know who that's going to, because I only have one bag. This thing keeps falling, flopping around. This is for me the Cadbury Dairy Milk buttons. 
with enamel on the front. Cause I, you know I love that shit. It's my crack. Mm, sorry, I went to go get my sister, but my uncle got it because he's home. And you know, he got the door. So anyway, next is this thing. You saw the back, so there's 10 of, no, not 10. Sit. These are sticky adhesives. Uh, I don't want that. But these are gift tags and there's 40 in here, but it says stick on. So are these stickers? I don't want to open it in case, well, I, I kind of can. Because there's a resealable thing and I can do it with, I'm just going to do it with one. Mm. Mm -hmm. Are we gonna focus? Please focus! This is as much as you're going to focus. Seriously, we want to focus on that thing. The words. Please and thank you. But yeah, it says peel and stick. I guess it's not so bad as because I thought it was the entirety of it. But it's just a little, you know, a little spot. So. That's okay. I'll, I'll deal with that. But anyway, there are 40 in here and this costs, costed me $1.98 and there's 40 in here. Those are four, there's four designs. I don't know how many is here, but that's a lot. And I like having those because I don't like the sticker ones. I don't like the full stick because it ruins the wrapping paper that you can reuse. Yeah, it's just very annoying. This is also for Manny, and this is also the Red Zone Old Spice Swagger Antiperspirant and Deodorant. Yeah, because he prefers the stick. I did get, I did find a antiperspirant and deodorant because he likes that combination, but he also prefers it in the stick as opposed to, well, this is 24 hour, it is, whatever as opposed to the spray like I do. I like that. So whatever, I found something. I got another bag of them. The M&M's White Chocolate Peppermint. Oh, so good. And I got another one of these. This is a mainstay mini whisk, all made of plastic. Cause I figure I'm going, I may have other people who want, you know, hot chocolate or something. So I might as well do that. Uh, this and the last one are for me. And this is the Lind Lint Lindor gingerbread. Uh, milk chocolate with gingerbread pieces and a delicately, delectably smooth gingerbread flavor center. Yeah. I am trying this out. I prefer drinking gingerbread. And my uncle actually gave me a pack from this limited edition gingerbread oatmeal box. I had it this morning. It's not my favorite. It meh. I, w I wouldn't personally buy it, and I wouldn't buy it. And this is the Daddy, shut up, phone. The Lind Lindor peppermint cookie milk chocolate with cookie pieces in a delectably smooth peppermint center. They had a bag of it in like this, but this was like a smaller one, and I want and it cost like a buck less. But it's the same thing. And I also found out they have a peppermint flavor. But this one has the cookie in it. And plus that one is dark chocolate, I believe. And I prefer the milk chocolate. And I'm just gonna check my phone for a second. Oh my God, this is hurt. Yes. Okay, yes. All right, and that's it from Walmart. So I'm going to put all of this stuff back in here so that I can later do my thing that I usually do at the end of the bottom of this video. Next, I got two bags from Dollar Tree. A shit ton of peanut stuff. I need a drink. Oh, orange juice is so good. So, there's a lot of duplicate stuff in here. And I don't know if I'm going to... Yep, there we go. Okay. We got two of the Planters Salted Cocktail Peanuts. I have one bag so far. I don't know where the other one... I think I got two. Of the Cavalier Foods chocolatey covered pretzels two bags of the 
also planters or Mr. Peanut, honey roast peanuts. I have one, one bag of the planters barbecue peanuts. I may have another one, I don't know. I have one bag of the corn nuts barbecue flavor, crunchy toasted corn. And this is for my dad, strictly for my dad because Manny doesn't really eat these and he hasn't said he wants them. But these are the planters milk covered, milk chocolate covered almonds. Okay, my dad does like eating almonds, so I got those. These, and I got another corn nut brand of the ranch flavor. Snyder's of Hanover pretzel pieces in the honey mustard onion flavor. And the last one in this bag is a Hershey, Hershey brand mix of the, like, it's a sweet and salty snack. Hershey's mini milk chocolate bars, milk chocolate pretzel bites, roasted salted almonds, and mini pretzels. I know one of these bags is for me because I wanted to try it. Mm. Here's the other bag. Alright, hold on. We'll put that back over there. I'm gonna put this back in this bag so that there's one. Okay, the only other thing I don't know about is the bar the planter's barbecue peanuts. I mean the the pretzel bites? I don't know. I might even get more of like those more salty stuff. Because dad likes the salty stuff. I gotta get less chocolate for Manny because he's not a chocolate person. So, there you saw that. Oh, a second bag. The O. Henry mix. Another sweet and salty snack. Chocolate covered caramels. Milk chocolate pieces. Peanuts. Peanut butter balls. And mini pretzels. Another from the Snyder's of Hanover pretzel pieces in the hot buffalo wing flavor. Crispy kernels salted peanuts. I got the same thing. Current crispy kernels peanuts, but these are honey roasted. That might have been too much glare on that. Oh. I got some nature's bounty toasted corn. Some salt toasted corn. This is for me. This is by the Palmer brand. They finally got the Palmer brand back over there. And I found, and I saw these over at Walmart, the Palmer brand. Interesting. These are Holiday Bells milk chocolate. I love eating the chocolate bells. Chocolate bells are great. I might get another bag. I have to try those out first because some chocolates are not great. I'm just so disappointed they did not have the pumpkin spice cups. Fall Halloween this year. <sighs> they weren't even at Walmart because I would have seen them. Anyway, here is another Hershey's brand. The cookies and cream mix. A sweet and salty snack. Hershey's cookies and cream mini bars, chocolate cookie bits, vanilla cookie bits, and mini pretzels. This one. This one, I eat like everything in this one because I like eating all of them. I'm very rare to eat pretzels, but those little pretzel balls, perfect for me to eat. And I got another Hershey's mix, regular Hershey's. And last things in here, I got two of each, are the beaver roast, peanuts roasted and salted, with, made with sea salt. And that's the last from Dollar Tree. So we're gonna put everything in there, and then we get to Dollar. Oh my god, this is everything from Dollarama, and it's so fucking heavy! Uh, okay. I got two bags of these because one's for me and one's for my sister because I... This is the D Gourmet Potato Chips brand in the plain Ripple. I got a bag in barbecue for my dad, so there's dad and Lauren's chips taken care of. This was surprising to me that they have this there, but it's great because my sister eats these. These are the Harvest Snaps Low Salt Green Pea Crisps in the original flavor. These are gluten-free. And these are at Dollarama, which is great. I love it that they're there. 
Now I gotta get into all this tiny nitty gritty stuff. It's all this chocolate and peanut salty sh All this stocking stuffer stuff. Oh, let's just get in there. I got a two pack crisp, coffee crisp regular. A mmm, cad. This is by Nestle. A Cadbury Mr. Big Original. A Hollow Santa. This is for my sister. Those two things were for dad. A Twix for my dad. I got two of these. It is the D Gourmet Barbecue Peanuts. And though I got two of them, one for dad and one for Manny. And then I also got it in the Roasted and Salted. Also, one for dad and one for Manny. They're somewhere in here. Somewhere. Cadbury Crunchy is a sponge chocolate. For dad. Any chocolate I bring up, um, they're majority for my dad unless I state so. So, cause I have a shit ton of this chocolate in here for my dad so I don't want to keep, keep saying it's for my dad. Like this, this is an arrow by Nestle for my dad. The other bag, this is for my dad from also by the uh, D Gourmet brand are smoked almond. These are from the, the for my dad. I'm only saying it for the chocolate bars. This I have other stuff. This is again the Rocher Blanc, Rocher Blanc brand of almonds covered in milk chocolate. Again, Manny hasn't stated that he likes eating almonds, so almonds are just for my dad. I got a chocolate sienna for Lauren. A Kit Kat crunchy. This is from my sister. This is the normal size, the degree dry protection shower clean and visible anti purse wound 24 hour protection. A Reese's peanut butter O Henry. Hershey's whole almond creamy milk chocolate bar. A regular Hershey's milk chocolate bar. A regular O. Henry. Uh, this is by Nestle. A This is Big Turk. It is a Turkish delight candy, if you didn't read there. Here's the other barbecue bag. This is another uh, Rocher Blanc brand. It is almonds covered in dark chocolate. Another Rocher, Rocher Blanc, but these are salted pistachios covered in milk chocolate. And these are for Manny because he specifically said he wants pistachios. Ah, you fell down, Santa. I have a two pack of crew socks in four to ten shoe size. These were a lot. I've been telling you the price, so I really don't really fudging care. So these are for my sister. These don't have a brand. But yeah, these are just for my sister because everyone gets so in your stockings every year. Everyone gets socks. And my really long receipt. It's not as long as some other ones that I've gotten. I got another Nestle Kit Kat chunky, but this is for Manny because he likes Kit Kat occasionally. So I have some chocolate, but I gotta have the majority of like salty stuff for him. I got two of these because one's for Manny, one's for Dad. And this is the Cooper brand, size 10 to 13, and you get two pairs of socks. And this, I had to make sure that this is, there is cotton in it. And this is 46% cotton, so, you know, it feels nice on his feet. And I couldn't find the other ones that I usually get, so. And I didn't really want to get thermal because, like, Manny's already, like, a hot oven sometimes, so. These, they're good. This is for myself. I needed more of these hangers. These are from the Maurice Closet Solutions 10 plastic covered metal hangers. And this is new. They have put, you know, rubber blunts on them. They're not really sharp. Let me get one off. It's sort of sharp. They just basically cut it. But, you know, it's like a rough plasticky edge. So they put rubber tips on them. And I got the, uh, the silver color. Yeah, this is silver. I thought this, or it's more like a pearly white. I don't know. It was looking white in store, but right now it's, and even on camera, it's like this pearly, shiny silver color. Glass toothpaste, and this is the Colgate brand 
total clean mint and this is for dad just because i don't know his teeth situation but yeah I got another colgate brand and this is for my sister and you know cavity protection so this is the jerk wait that's french sorry i'll show you the english side this is the jergens mild soap pure natural and i get you get three bars in here which is nice And this is this will, uh, this will either be for my dad or my dad or Manny. Not sure which because Manny says he's sensitive skin, so I try to get him more like like the goat's milk soap, and I do have that, which I will get to soon. I bought some spaghettios. This is by the Campbell brand, and an original. Franco American and I love these. They used to only be in um, it used to be in Canada, then it used to only be in America, and now they're back in Canada only in Dollarama. And I'm seriously happy because these are fucking good. I have another soap bar and it is this is the Yardley London brand. Naturally moisturizing bath bar. Bath bar. Ah oh, shit. I thought it was soap. Are you not soap? It says it gently cleanses like it says while gently cleansing so there are you are you a soap you are in the soap i don't know but this is the uh, english lavender scent calms and soothes with pure lavender extracts and essential oils oh and this is not tested on animals it says i guess it just says the sense is to make bath time a tranquil retweet. Retweet? Retreat. Wow. But this is for my sister and I'm guessing it's a soap bar. It's not like this. This is soap. Yeah, this is mild soap. This is soap. This. I got two more of these. This is the famous brand Sealed in Freshness Salted Pineapple. That's what it says. And I have two of these sort of small like brands. And I have to tell you, the Walmart that I went to today had like zero pe peanut stuff or salty stuff. They had like, you know, like the tall containers of peanuts stashed away in like the, ca the cashier aisle. Like when you go up and there's like a bunch of stuff on either side of you. That's where I found like this tall thing of peanuts. There's no peanut stuff, no salty stuff within the section of like, oh, this is Christmas stuff. You can give this as gifts or holiday, whatever, whatever. Zero salty peanut stuff there. They don't like, there may have been peanutty stuff or salty stuff, but they were in like chocolate tins. No, no, that's not this. You, this thing. Where are these things? Here is Manny's soap bar. This is by Caprina, fresh goat's milk soap, original formula. Not because you know Manny says he has sensitive skin. No, Dad actually has sensitive skin because he gets actually like red marks from itching, which is like also caused by dryness but it's mainly because he has like sensitive skin and he can't use certain detergents and soaps and such and he has like a cream for it whereas Manny Snickers bar we got a Crest brand this is the let's get the English the side the 3d white toothpaste three benefits in one removes up to 80% of surface stains in the Arctic fresh Arctic fresh scent taste and this is the smaller one there is an actual longer one but I was able to you know they had this smaller size whitens strengthens and protects oh there you go there's a three stuff no you can go with toothpaste I got a bag of Inca chips plantain chips which are gluten-free for my sister a small bag of M&Ms just some regular M&Ms for my sister Shampoo and conditioner for my sister. This is the Garnier Fructis Fortifying Shampoo Conditioner. Clean and fresh for normal hair. There, I think, there's, there should be more, like, less 
like, you know, less expensive ones. But I could only find these ones, which were like three bucks. And then I was finding ones which were four bucks. And I was like, there should be cheaper ones. Like, non, like, not these ones. Like, these are like brand names that you get over at Walmart. This is for my dad, his deodorant. And it is the Men's Degree Dry Protection Body Heat Activated Cool Rush Antiperspirant. Stay protected all day long. I got a bag of uh, almond M&Ms. This is for my dad and it is the Dial for Men Ultimate Clean Hair and Body Wash. Yes, complete freshness, clean rinse technology. And the last thing I have is mouthwash for my boyfriend. This is the Aura Care Mouthwash and Gargle Freshman. I got this and I made sure that there is alcohol in here because Nanny likes, you know, that alcohol burn. And the second ingredient is alcohol. So, cuz you know, when they fr when they pr put when they order the ingredients, they always put the majority the thing that has the most stuff first. So, the first thing is water or aqua. And then the next thing is alcohol. So, this should be fine. Yeah. And it's made in Canada. So yeah, I'm gonna put this down. Oh, I'm so heavy. Yeah, that's everything from Dollarama and everything I bought today. I wasn't. Able, I did go to Urban Planet. I didn't buy anything because I couldn't really move because like Dollar Dollarama was fucking heavy. I even went into uh, Winners. I actually went in there and went to the section I usually go to, but I couldn't really buy anything. It was like. I don't really want this thing that I actually picked up and then I'm like, screw it. I'm not gonna get anything. Uh, so yeah, I'll have to go next week to go do those other things that I wanna do. Cause then I will not be carrying all this heavy shit. Mm -hmm. And I am cold, I need to put my heater on. So yeah, I hope you liked this haul. If you did, hit that like button down below and you can leave your comments down below. And if you, if you start doing your shopping early. I, uh, I'm not exactly early. Some people are like super early and like they're doing their shopping in like July or May. But this is, you know, this, some people are like, why are you shopping then? You, why you should, you're supposed to be Christmas shopping in December. It's like, why do I want to shop with a shit ton of people crowding around. I like it. I like doing this because, you know, I can get all the stuff I want without stuff being bought out and all that such. So yeah, just like, like you, like if you do shop your Christmas shopping earlier than November, because that's when I do my shopping, the majority of it, I do sort of shop throughout the year, but it depends on what it is and who it's for. But yeah. You can leave in the comments below of like how early you start Christmas shopping. And there goes my phone again, which is just my game. Yeah. Um, just don't be negative. Don't be nasty in the comments because we do not need that in the world. We do not need people being, putting people down and being nasty. Okay. We don't need that. And if this is the first time you're watching my video, please hit that big red subscribe button down, down there by my picture for more hauls, book reviews, let's plays, unboxing, unbagging, because something's coming a bubble wrap envelope or a plastic bag wrap thingy. And next week I will have a Kohl's unbagging, because my book is in. A vlog, my random vlog, and random random videos. I have no idea what to categorize. I gotta go put all this shit back in the bag so that it's not everywhere in front of me so that I can do my document stuff. Oh my god, this is gonna be... I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Which tonight I hope, you know, I'm going to do a let's play tonight. I am going to do one, maybe two, because it depends, I, however many I do, it depends on how, how I, like how I feel. Cause right now I want a fucking nap. I need a nap. Okay. I need a nap. Uh, yeah. I hope you enjoyed my video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.